My name is Erin and I'm a registered nurse. I have been a registered nurse for 10 years now. I started out my nursing career like most others do, not really knowing what was in vaccines or what risks came along with administering them. I gave out thousands of vaccines in my career as a nurse. Um, and it wasn't until an employee alerted me to a particular ingredient that was in vaccines that I was really, really started to question what was in them and if they were safe for people. I thought that they were just safe for everyone, for everyone to get across the board one size fits all, like I had been taught. Um, and once I learned about this particular ingredient, I, I knew this ingredient was bad. It was aluminum. I knew aluminum was a neurotoxin. And I really started questioning why we were injecting this into everyone and whether it was safe. I was pregnant at the time, about to have my first baby, and I needed to make a decision for my child. And so I started researching and I started doing some digging. And what I found and what I've seen since that time seven years ago is that vaccines are not a one size fits all. They come with risk in administering them and they have injured many, many children and many people. In medicine and in the medical industry, we talk about how everyone's bodies are so different. Everyone reacts differently to different medications, different procedures. And the question of is one size fits all medicine good medicine is a big question. I think when we treat vaccines like they're one size fits all, then we're missing some big pieces. The big problem I have with where our government is headed when it comes to vaccines is mandating a product for everyone that comes with risk. We have to maintain informed consent. We have to have freedom over what is injected into our bodies and our children's bodies. We live in America. This should be a basic human right to refuse something that you think can harm you or has harmed you in the past.